The Great Western's 3200, or Earl class, were given the name Duke Dogs because the boilers came from Dukes and the frames came from Bulldogs. Because of this, they became one of the last steam locomotives to retain outside frames. It all came about in December 1929 when Duke number 3265 was withdrawn. Her cab, cylinders and motion alongside the boiler and smoke box were fitted to the straight topped frames of Bulldog number 3365. This resulted in an engine with stronger frames, but a lighter axle loading, allowing her to work on the Cambrian network in North Wales. The story behind naming this class was particularly amusing. Aristocratic Great Western directors wanted their names on locomotives, and at the time, Charles Collett thought that the Duke Dogs, with their old-fashioned appearance, would be perfect. Needless to say, when the directors waited at Paddington for the unveiling of these new engines, they were less than impressed with Collett's joke. Apart from the prototype, which remained in the Duke classification, there were 29 Duke dogs built between 1936 and 39, but with the introduction of the Manners and the BR Standard 4s, they became surplus to requirements as time went by, and by 1961 they had all been withdrawn. The surviving engine, number 9017, Earl of Berkeley, was purchased by the Bluebell Railway Preservation Society and arrived there on February the 15th, 1962, where she's remained ever since. It's interesting how, despite being built in 1938, the frames originate from 1906 and the boiler and cab from 1899. Funny, isn't it? This engine was built in the same year as Mallard, but if you put the two of them together, it'll be like putting a Sopwith Camel next to Concord. But however you want to call it, quirky, ironic, old-fashioned, this engine has become one of the most unique survivors in the Bluebell Railway's locomotive fleet. Mm -hmm.